I recognize this may be hard to believe considering the cold that's gripping so many of us around the nation. Maybe it will help if you think back to the summer when we were all cranking up the AC. Because 2014 will go down as the warmest year around the globe in recorded history. NBC's Ann Thompson explains. For many Americans, 2014 will be remembered as the year of digging out. I'm done with winter, officially. Beginning and ending under a pile of white. <laughs> I'm ready to move. <laughs> but for the planet as a whole, 2014 is set to be the warmest year on record. Continuing a century-long trend from cooler than average temperatures in 1913 to a predominance of above average temperatures in 2013. This year's record fueled by the warming oceans with seven consecutive months of new high temperatures. While yearly changes may play a role, NOAA says the prime suspect is climate change. Greenhouse gases warm the atmosphere. That atmospheric temperature increase then penetrates into the ocean as well. On land, Australia sweltered through its hottest spring on record with temperatures topping 100 degrees. Researchers say this was Europe's hottest year in 500 years. Even Siberia felt the heat. The coldest town in the world, Oymyakon, averaged a record 9.5 degrees in February. Usually, it's 51 below. All in stark contrast to much of the U.S. This year, the west was very warm. The central and eastern parts were average to below average. In fact, January to November were the coldest in the lower 48 since 1997, despite record warmth in Arizona and California, making it a small cold spot in a record warm year. Ann Thompson, NBC News, New York.